everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be testing for you a Jeffree Star highlighter. I've got a highlighter in the shade called Princess Cut. It's absolutely adorable. It is kind of a Barbie pink highlighter, so I'll show you now. This is what the packaging looks like. It's in this bright Barbie pink box, which is really cute. It's called Skin Frost, and I picked up the shade Princess Cut. This is what the actual highlighter pan looks like. It's absolutely huge. You'll see next to the palm of my hand. It's massive, and it weighs a ton as well. This is what the packaging looks like. It feels very sturdy. It says Princess Cut, which is the shade name on the back. They did have a few colours. I've always been attracted to this one and I had it many years ago as well. Inside you do get a full pan size mirror. And then the highlighter itself looks like this. As you'll see, it's got a star printed in the centre and it's a very sparkly peachy pink. The texture of these highlighters feels like butter. They're absolutely beautiful. And they can obviously be used on your cheeks as a highlighter, a blush topper type thing, or an eyeshadow, of course. So there is a multi-use purpose to this product. As you can see from the swatch, it's this beautiful baby pink colour and it's got these beautiful shimmers in. I'll do the swatch back here just so you can see it. I have got a big ring light on, so I'll try and get it in different angles for you. It's got a really nice sheen to it. So this for a highlighter is quite out. Out there but as you can see as I'm moving it around it has got a really nice shine to it and you can use it as an eyeshadow as well which I think is really cool it literally matches my bobble perfectly so what I'm going to do today is pop this on my cheeks what I find with the formula of Jeffree Star it is really easily blendable as you can see there I've just pushed that same swipe of product around my hand and it goes on for ages you can really blend it out and it's very beautiful You'll see now I've blended the shade out with my finger. It has dispersed more and it's a lot more subtle. So if you want that kind of glow, you can achieve that too. I thought this video might be interesting in case you wanted to try the highlighters out yourself. I'm just going to pop this princess cut shade on my cheeks. That's got a really nice glow to it. I do really like pink highlighters and I find that the Jeffree Star products in general, the eyeshadows, the highlighters, they are really blendable and they look really nice. I'm just going to build that up a little bit more. There isn't much of a pink shine on there, it is a slight pink tint but obviously I've got blush underneath but I think this is a really nice shade. I'm going to do the same on the other side. And I definitely think highlighters and blushes are my favourite part of my makeup routine. Just because they can make you look really healthy and I like that. I'm just going to pop highlighter around the other zones that I'd pop it on normally. When I've got my hair up like this, I do like to pop it on my forehead. And it's a very nice shine. I'm really liking that. I kind of just want to keep adding it. It's beautiful. I do think as well in summer this would look absolutely beautiful. I'm very impressed with this highlighter. The formula is really easily blendable. It just feels lovely on the skin. Very lightweight and I'm very excited to give this a go throughout spring and summer. I think it'll look absolutely beautiful in summer. I'm very happy with that. A beautiful highlighter. As I said there were different shades should you not like the pink tint. Although I do think this just has a warm glow. It doesn't come off as Barbie pink. But obviously if you were to swipe in the pan like that you are going to get more of a pink shade shine which could be used on the eyelids. That was me testing the Jeffree Star Princess Cut Highlighter. I absolutely loved this. I think if you are looking to try a Jeffree Star product, one of the highlighters might be the way to start. Just because you are getting a multi-purpose product here, you can use this as a highlighter and eyeshadow. So it might be a nice way to test out their formulas. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more beauty, makeup and hair content, then please subscribe because I upload three times a week. And if you want to see more, you can follow me on Instagram. That's at Zoe Glitter Zoe with a Y. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.